Welcome to Retro Crisis. In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can install Sequario's Mega Bezel TV backgrounds. In order to use these, you need to make sure you have Mega Bezel configured within RetroArch. I've made a short video guide on how to do that linked in the description below. Once you've configured Mega Bezel, you need to go to Sequario's homepage, which I'll also link in the description below. Once you're here, you need to go to this link, which says download latest release and click it. And then you'll see this page. And what you need to do is click on this green code button and go to download zip. Once the zip file has finished downloading, you need to extract it to its own folder. Within RetroWatch, you need to go to shaders and then make a new folder. And we need to call it mega underscore bezel underscore community and open it. And then what you want to do here is drag and drop the Sequario TV backgrounds version two folder that you extracted a few moments ago. There we go. And that should be the installation completed. Now all you need to do is open RetroArch. Once your game has loaded, press F1 to go to the quick menu and then go down to shaders and then go to load, Mega Bezel Community and Sequario TV Backgrounds version two main and go to presets. And then we have two options. We have TV console and TV console night. Let's try TV console first. And here you can see a number of shader presets. So let's try one at random first. Let's try this one and press enter to load. Excellent. And then press F1 to go back to the game. And there we go. You can see a, a pretty cool Nintendo TV screen complete with a CRT shader. Okay, now go and try some of the other shader presets and let me know which ones your favorites are. 